All right, guys, so with the end of 2022 coming to an end, and well, it's now this is going to be my last video of 2022, so we're going to look forward into 2023 and what movies I'm kind of most anticipating and can't wait to actually watch and sit down and enjoy. Now, keep in mind, this is no particular order, and I'm just mentioning movies that I know for a fact are coming out, or, in it, or I'll get to some of these other ones here soon. I do want to see Megan. It's the first one coming out in 2023. Um... It just this movie interests me for some real strange reason. I, I just like the killer doll aspect. I've always liked Chucky. I like the Annabelle movie, so I'm looking forward to that. Uh, it's like a movie hits every month too, in in this year. Uh, coming out in February, we have Ant Man three, Quantum Mania. Uh, we get introduced to Kang, uh, which I can't Kang the Conqueror, so I can't wait. And he's probably um, one of the biggest reasons why I want to see this. I'm not, I was not a big fan of the second Ant Man movie. It's one of my worst MCU movies, and also the first one was all right. So this one is anticipated only because of Kang mostly. Um, and then in March we get Scream Six. Now, if you watched my recent uh, video of my top 10 movies of 2022 scream 5 was my number one and i really liked that movie it brought back scream so here we go with another one following one year later um it is i am anticipating it to be a good movie but i'm also anticipating it to be a bad movie um one because of nev campbell not coming back so i'm in, just because of the fact they're releasing it so quickly i'm a little worried on it uh, Super Mario Brothers it comes out in March, uh, not March, I'm sorry, April, and everything, and it, to be, uh, to be hyped for a cartoon movie for me is really, really hard, because this one, and also the Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, are the two cartoon movies I'm actually looking forward to this, this year, um, and I'm actually knowing that I'm going to go see these movies in theaters, um, I haven't watched Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, but probably one time I did finally just recently got it um, added to my voodoo. So therefore, I'll be re-watching it. Um, it's just I'm not into animated movies, but these two movies got me interested, especially the Mario one. I really That one really looked really well um, and really good. So looking forward to these. The Flash comes out this year. Maybe. Uh, with the way DC is getting revamped and everything, who knows what we're going to get out of fucking DC this year. Are they even guaranteed movies anymore? Are we going to get The Flash? Are we going to get Blue Beetle? Are we going to get Aquaman 2? And I think there's some other one in there as well. I just can't put my finger on it right, right at the moment. But it's like... Uh, oh, Shazam 2 and everything. And that movie just needs to go to fucking HBO Max. Just straight out, I'm just telling you. But these three would be the three I would be looking forward to. As long as they stick to their dates and everything for this year, I am looking forward to these movies. I think they will be good. They could usher in the next faint way of DC. Another movie that I think is is slated right now to come out Christmas this year, uh, coming year, is Gremlins 3. I would love a Gremlins 3 but the question is, this has been a development hell for years. Are we going to get it? And then they're also pushing for Ghostbusters Afterlife 2 this year. If both these movies come, are slated to come, these probably were my two most anticipated and the ones I'm looking forward to the most this year if they are legit coming out this year. Anymore, you can't never fucking tell. Um, there was a lot of other movies that were coming out this year that, uh, you know, just look good. Creed 3 looked really well. I can't wait. I think that one's going to be good. Little Mermaid is like a... You know, you got a bunch of... Other, like Transformers, Rise of the Beast, Indiana Jones, uh, the Marvels. All of them coming out. Yeah, they're not... They're not high on my list. And then you got the the horror aspect, which is Saw 10, Exorcist, Nun 2, Insidious 5, and The Meg 2. Again, not really hyped on these we'll see when trailers actually get released let me know what you guys are looking forward to in 2023 leave it in the comment box below if you're not a subscriber well let me subscribe to the channel guys till next time